We have caller now. Oh, la, go, la, go, la, go, la, go, la, go. Hey everyone, welcome back to channel. Today we're back. Kolaberg. All right, sorry. I, it's been a while since I've done a new intro, so I thought I'd I thought I'd do a new intro. Yes, I've been having a little bit of fun with this Blockworks Summer Part Two update lately, and we're gonna be doing another build with one of the new items. Originally, in the um, build mode here, I wanted to build something with the square sail shade canopy, but instead, I think we can do something with a sleek modern pergola. We're gonna make a modern house with this, and it is currently storming outside. Oh my gosh! Wow. It's raining. <laughs> okay. But yeah, I don't know. Maybe I could do something with this. Should I should I do something with this? I don't know. I've never really seen these IRL, but I know they're a thing, obviously. But doesn't it just... It looks silly. It looks like a little trampoline. So what I've been experimenting with this pergola is that... Um, I'm gonna go ahead and make it wall height at least. So that way we can make it like two stories if we wanted. I think I want to make a two-story modern pergola house. So if we make this wall height a floor above it... Because you can't, you can't put these on top of each other, unfortunately. But if you put a floor on top of this pergola here place this here you're able to create you're able to create something here okay it looks a little a little interesting but i think what we can make with it maybe a modern house for sure i don't actually have to work on a roof really because it comes with the roof not really a good roof because you know things can fall through there but i think we can work with this it looks like a giant table hey i'm glad they fixed the cola machine i don't know when but that's fixed now let's see how shall we go about this what kind of house guys oh i want to do another beach house it is summer at least in the northern hemisphere so i'm gonna make a lot of beach houses for the summer and i think i might do like a beach town project i'm thinking of definitely doing like some sort of beach boardwalk some sort of beach town so that's gonna be fun oh my god <gasps> oh my god i don't know if the mic can pick up that sound but it, the thunder just happened right now yeah i'm putting the glass here all right this is gonna be fun i'm gonna have a fun time with this all right let's do this gonna add a wall here and this will be where the door will be actually no that's not gonna work how about we do this and then we do the oh my gosh i don't know the shape of my house another thing i haven't realized is i need to figure out how to get to the second floor maybe i could use the deck stairs for that i'm gonna try to use a lot of the new items okay we'll probably use the deck stairs somewhere out here like this i think would be nice maybe two stairs no not two stairs why don't i rescale it ahaha we can do that now <laughs> keep forgetting that's a thing let me grab this window I'm gonna put it here. I haven't done my layout, silly me. Okay. okay, let's put these above. Like this, like this. Okay, maybe not like that. Yeah, that's pretty simple. That's pretty good, right? I still haven't figured out my layout. What is the layout going to be? I don't know. I don't want to just do three by threes, I don't think. I can shrink this down to make it like a two, two by three. Oh, uh, it's so ugly. Oh my gosh. Oh no. <laughs> I don't know where this is going, guys. I'm making my own custom windows and everything. This is a no privacy house too, by the way. I'm I need to I need to figure this out. I think this will look okay. Oh, 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 oh. I was thinking if I made like noise on my mic, you could hear the thunder. Oh, lightning and the thunder. <laughs> Ooh, wait, I just dyed it. I just dyed it and I think I like this. Do I like that? I think I like it. Oh my. I just put a gable roof on top of this and now I'm feeling like I should not do a modern house. What if we did another type of beach house? This is actually, I think this would look great as a roof texture though. I like the wicker for furniture and like maybe even roof. Who told me this was okay? Who told me? Nobody. Nobody told me this was okay. I told myself this was okay. I don't know. I feel like this could work somehow. You know, I'm gonna work on the landscaping a little bit. I can't, I can't really decide what I want for this house to look like. This will totally help. Like having a variety of like sized trees actually does help a lot. This is so close to the sidewalk. If I didn't have free camera, this would be a pain to like get a thumbnail of. I don't know, I kind of like it. I like this. I am sticking with this theme. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's... add this okay add the rocks in front of the water and then the plants outside of this let's see where we put the rocks near the water because like wouldn't that be better put the rocks near here and then the plants on the outside okay that looks better wow i'm actually doing the exterior first why 
Why is that? <laughs> this is so random. <laughs> oh my gosh. If you look up, look at it, it's not bad. I like it. I think that looks kind of cool. All these videos are me just roasting myself all the time, for sure. Like, I'm pretty sure you guys noticed a pattern with these videos where I just like, eh, does that look good? Does that look bad? That looks decent. I don't know. Welcome to an unsure builder. Soon who is definitely improving, but I'm not sure what he's doing. I still don't know what I'm doing. Like, lay out my gosh, please. Please. <laughs> <gasps> or this could be a porch thingy. Ah, uh, yep, I figured it out. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm just going with the flow. Just going with the flow. All right, I have a little porch there. There we go. Something going on in the back of the house. Okay. Oh, ooh, a bird feeder would be kind of cool to put here too. Wow. Oh, wow. <gasps> Why do you look so cool from this angle? And then you like look at the rest of it. It's like, okay, that's that's all right. Oh, I'm going to put the patio furniture out here too. Not the pa It's not a patio. Like the, the outdoors, the garden furniture stuff set, whatever. Where do I actually put this? Oh, here. Right here would be nice. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I can already imagine it, guys. I can already imagine it. And then we have the uh, the right one. Like this. And then we have like, we have the armchair. Maybe there. This just looks so cool. It's definitely the landscaping. I'm spending a lot of time on the exterior first. Like this is a this is a shock. I actually am having fun with the exterior first. I don't know, just have something out here. Ooh, maybe I could put like a hammock out here. Wow, this is truly a summer build. Oh, wow, that looks so cool. Okay. Why do I think this is okay? This is not okay. Are they too close to each other? I don't know how I don't know how this technically works. You can tell. You can tell I definitely don't know what I'm doing. And we can also use these like these path lights as well. I think these square ones will be nice to light up the path. Huh? Wait, did I forget that? Did I forget the end table? I was looking through the comments of the video. I don't know. Did I forget this? Did I forget that? Did I forget to show this? Oh well, it's okay. That is so nice. I love this set. It's one of my favorite sets ever. Ooh, a little thingy here. Yeah, look at that. <gasps> I like how I'm making an actual house out of the pergolas, but like making it look decent. I'm, I'm making a full-on house with the pergolas. It was going to be a joke. Like this whole thing was going to be a joke, but it's actually, I think it's turning out kind of decent. Oh my gosh. I love how you can expand these some more. Wait, huh? Were you able to do this before? Were you able to do that with the bushes? I thought it was just like up and like, I thought it was just like up and then this way, you know? But I think you can actually expand these bushes a lot more now. I think there's an option. Wait, what? That wasn't like that before. It definitely wasn't. That's another small, that's another hidden change right there is that this got more rescalable options, I think. Cause I can only remember being it taller and then like this way. There was no way there was like this too. Am I blind? I love the pillows too. These pillows are really nice. I might, I'm just gonna keep it the default colors and textures, like, sorry. Okay, I'm gonna start decorating the interior now. Let's start with the bedroom first, like this floor up here. This is gonna be fun. So definitely bedroom's gonna be up here. And I think there'll be an ensuite, like luxury bathroom of some sort. Yeah, there's no privacy. There's definitely no privacy with this house. Plain old shower here. And then we're gonna have a toilet here. I'm gonna have like some counter sinks. Sure, why not? Oh, we can still actually place a mirror here right on the window. Okay, this bathroom's kind of sad. It's kind of sad. Maybe I should have like a barbecue out here too. Let me get a barbecue grill. Thing. Yeah, what is this spot for without a barbecue? A barbecue there. Oh, maybe we could have like a table here too. Like a dining table. Like a round one would be nice right here. By the way, I am recording this at 8 a.m. I don't know why, but my sleep schedule is going to be terrible. Where shall I put my kitchen? You know what? I think we'll, my, we might have a U-shaped kitchen. Hmm. Let's do the bedroom first. Let's do the bedroom. Let's get the bed. It's gonna be a little difficult to actually <laughs> furnish this house because I, I have to like go into the actual home now to decorate it. I guess the bed can sit there. There's no nightstands. We could kind of squeeze some nightstands. Yep, just have these at the side. Let's have the dresser like back over here, I guess. We have the dresser there. About to make the bed like hurricane gray. That's totally fine. Maybe I'll use this jungle leaf pattern. I don't know. I don't use it very often or at all. But you know, let's use it because I don't use it. Why not? <laughs> this house is already beachy themed, so might as well just keep going with it. I mean, that's all I really want to add in my bedroom. I don't think there's anything else I want to add. Maybe like a clothing rack or something there. Maybe another plant. There we go. I think that's a bit better. Okay. That's all I want to do for the bedroom. So the first, the top floor is already done. 
That's really all there is to it. And the thing is, I don't really have to mess with colors and textures too much. Now we can work on our kitchen and our like living room and stuff. So how much you want to bet I'm about to do another island. I've been doing islands for every single one of my houses lately. But this one is modern again, so I can do it. And apparently the ovens are, they do cook a little bit faster than the cheaper ones. Just like a slight difference, I think. It's actually some really good information. And then I'm going to use this fridge here. No, 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 no. I don't think this is, this is a good... Oh no. Oh, <laughs> oh no. <gasps> the slush machine. Oh, maybe I could put that in the kitchen. No, I want to leave it outside. This is where it should be. I don't know. Can we fit three people here? I guess so. You can fit. This is our, pretty much our kitchen. There's not many, there's not much storage, but it has things you do need. Oh, maybe I could put the living chairs out here. That's not too bad. Not interesting. Oh, I love that. Okay. That's not unusual, I don't think. That's another place to sit. Okay, let's do living room next. And I think living room can fit perfectly here. And I'm still going to use the outdoor um, furniture set indoors. Because why not? This house is giving me like a vacation vibes. Okay, you know what? We might just do... I'm wasting money. Hold on. <laughs> When I told you guys I was gonna use this a lot, be prepared for t be prepared to see it a lot. Okay, just be prepared. Prepare, be prepared to see more summer stuff. Cause I'm definitely, I think for my next project for sure, I want to do a boardwalk or like some type of beach town. Oh, that'd be so fun. We can do another grand opening as well. Need a coffee table. Let's get an end table. You hear those chimes? Yeah, I hear them too. Quite nice. Okay, okay chimes. All right chimes, thank you. Okay, we're running out of money. So I think on this wall here, we might just use bookshelves, you know, just, just some bookshelves. One of the main reasons I don't, I don't use the empty ones, I'm too, I just, I'm too lazy, but I have no excuse because I have all the time now. We can have all right, you know what? That's pretty much all I want to do for this house. I think I'm done. All right, guys, let's tour it. <gasps> I have $161, but don't worry. I will work for it video. Hold on one moment, I'm depressed. Okay guys. Our house is done. Our house is finished. Let's go ahead and do a 360. So, oddly enough, yes, this house is made out of pergolas. The new modern pergolas we got. And it actually, I was able to transform this quite a bit. Just a little bit. Okay, it's a bit flat. It's still a bit flat. You know, around the plot is flat. But here's just the house. Oasis, I guess, right here. Just a body of water. You know, outside here, we got a playground for the kids. It's literally only a one bedroom house. So it's definitely not a family home unless I somehow made another bedroom. But all your outdoor activities can be here. So let's go ahead and go to the inside. Let's start with the first floor. Uh, the entryway is a bit like... My bills. <gasps> My bills! <laughs> Wait! I'm going to work. I'm going to work. <laughs> Not in the middle of my tour. Okay, I got some money. I, I, I worked for some money. All right, anyways. Anyways, as I was saying before, the lights turned off on me. Thank you, Blockburg City, for turning off my utilities. As you walk in, the entryway is, you know, not much is going on, but you have a, you know, a seating area over here to read your books and stuff. Chill. Have a nice drink. Think about life. On your left over here is your living room, which is also pretty simple. And then right past that is the kitchen. And yeah, standard kitchen. I got a green oven. <laughs> I just wanted a random burst of color in here. And that green oven is speaking volumes. Yep, there's that, you know, pretty normal standard kitchen. Yeah, okay. I think that's the first floor, yeah. We go through the back, yeah, it's just back porch that doesn't have anything. So if we go to the second floor now, this is where your like rooftop balcony is sort of with the outdoor, the new outdoor seating. Have our, let's get a nice cola slush while we're touring. And then you also have like a dining, outdoor dining table. So if you want to make some food, come out here to eat if you like. And then we go to the actual bedroom area. So this is... Yeah, the bedroom, pretty normal. And then, of course, an ensuite bathroom, which does not have <laughs> an actual flooring. Oh my. <laughs> uh, uh, I love that. This is great. Yeah, privacy. So, yeah, just stay standard bathroom. It's giving me very summery vibes for sure. Summer, beachy, tropical sort of vibe. I'm actually really surprised this worked out with pergolas, you know? That's, that's the house. If I sit down, can I still drink my cola? Oh, nope, my cola gone. My cola gone. Anyway, guys, that will basically wrap up today's uh, block break episode. I thought it turned out pretty cool. Um, and yeah, if you guys did enjoy this episode, you found it inspiring, entertaining in a way, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And make sure you hit the subscribe button too, because it is completely free. Thank you all for taking the time out here to watch this. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Have a great day. Peter Bread signing out. Goodbye, everybody. I don't understand.
It's very interesting though. Very interesting.